I want to use some titles to help me tell my story. And I can either have a title sitting by itself against a black background, or I can have it sitting over the top of the image as what's called an overlay. Now I find the easiest way to do titles is drag the playhead past to the end of the movie and then next to the split button there's a T button. So I click on T, T for text, then opens up this window. And I can use that for just typing text in. Now that's now slightly off center, so I can use the buttons down here to help me with that. These ones with the orange bit will help me to just center everything up nicely. The text is a little bit boring. You can, if you're feeling adventurous, change the font manly yourself and add all the special effects yourself, but I find the easiest way to put something nice looking is to use these text styles down here. And just by clicking on each of these, you can see that it changes the look and the feel, add some nice drop shadows, glowing effects. So I'm happy with that, I'm going to recenter it again and then click on done. Now obviously the title's now over here. You can see it also in the project uh, media list, so underneath all the clips it's there as well. I'm going to take that, I'm just going to drop it in at the beginning. There we go. Now if I want to put a clip over the top of something, I'll go through the same process, find a blank space on the movie, click on the T button. Oops. There's Paul Chapels now. I'm going to find the same effect that I had before. There we go. I'm going to use this arrow button just to drag that down to the bottom. And now I want this to appear over that clip that we did in slow motion before, which is that one. So I click and I drag it, and this time instead of putting it on this line, I put it in the video 2 track. So I just drop that in there. So when I play that now, it now puts the title over the top of the image. If you want to go in and edit a title, all you really do is just double click it in the timeline and then use the different buttons for highlighting it, changing the text and the font.